It's 11.59 at Radio Free America, and this is Uncle Sam with music and the truth until dawn. Right now, I've got a few words for some of our brothers and sisters in the occupied zone. The chair is against the wall. The chair is against the wall. John has a long mustache. John has a long mustache. It's 12 o'clock, Americans, another day closer to victory. And for all of you out there on or behind the lines, this is your song. Two-way Tuesday. We focus on a different state each week and look at their firearms laws and firearms history. We feature a different gun owner's rights group and look at their history, focus, and successes. For more info on 2A organizations and laws, check out everysecondmatters.com. Good afternoon and welcome to our second episode, the first Tuesday of our new daytime uh, companion episode. So on Tuesdays we look at 2A. We look at our Second Amendment and we don't answer the phone to spam risks. We uh, talk about our Second Amendment and 2A organizations, and that's what we'll do today. So looking forward to some feedback tonight at midnight when we go live to do the other half of this show live on the uh, Daily Gun Show channel. Thanks for being here. Give us some feedback. Now is it time for our Second Amendment Advocate of the Week. And today's 2A Advocate of the Week is Dan Todd or Danny Todd co-host of Gun Freedom Radio, owner of AZ Firearms, uh, husband of Cheryl Todd, and two-way advocate. i uh, known Dan uh, through the Gun Freedom Radio podcast and meeting him at different events. I think I've known, I've met Dan more at rallies than I have at his store. Uh, but then, of course, uh, he's got the gun shop and he's got an interesting um taste in firearms so his shop is definitely not a one-trick pony and uh, it's not just a random assortment of junk like a lot of pawn shops end up being a very fun shop a very immersive shop he has a ton of stuff there arranges it or sorts it and sorts it out in a way that's fun to uh, experience so i'm looking forward to uh having a chance to meet up with uh, dan at his shop sometime uh, but otherwise he's uh, our second amendment advocate of the week co-host of gun freedom radio owner of AZ Firearms and husband of Cheryl Todd. Now it is time for Patch of the Day. Next up on Patch of the Day will be the Florida Carry Patch that was part of our 2A Patch Batch in 2019, our first big uh, collaborative 2A patch batch effort. The Florida Carry organization has been around for quite a few years now and uh, working for open carry and concealed carry in Florida and uh, do all kinds of good work. They've uh, uh, recently been on the uh, Daily Bullet uh, over on the Second Amendment Foundation's uh, daily podcast so you can learn more information about them in a current interview. And this is our patch of the day. Uh, if you've got one from the 2A patch batch, let us know. If you've got one from Florida Carry itself, post them over on Instagram or Parlor. Now is it time for the channel of the day. This is our channel of the day. Go over to our YouTube channel. We click on the channel tab and we scroll through the channels that we subscribe to. Sometimes we go to the top of the list, sometimes we go to the bottom. I'm going to go to the middle of the list this time and we'll click on save the second. So we subscribe to quite a few channels. This one is pretty active. They used to be. Uh, and this is an organization that uh, is about three or four people, I think. And they uh, are focused on letting the members of the NRA uh, know what options they have. Although the options may be limited, there are still ways to salvage an, an organization that's 170 something years old with just 12 people manipulating it for the last 30 and uh, while lots of people are willing to watch it burn throw their hands up and just give bloomberg the win for free in fact a lot of people are efforting in my opinion to uh, work for bloomberg for nothing because they would actively like to see the nra burn for some reason uh, this is an organization that uh, doesn't make any excuses offers five uh, positions five points that you can that they are interested that they think could uh, affect change at the NRA and they petition to uh, take action on those five goals a smaller board of directors term limits for the board 
uh, director attendance, requiring attendance by the board members, uh, member engagement, so allowing and uh, avenues for that member engagement. And then again, a focus on Second Amendment, which I think a lot of people would like to see. Uh, and uh, that's a membership organization's opportunity or responsibility or um, I don't know what another word would be. So this is an organization that isn't afraid or isn't too lazy to do something or to just give it to Wayne or Bloomberg. And uh, I don't know if they'd describe themselves that way, but that's the way I'm describing it. Uh, if you want to check them out, please do. Save the second. They only have 300 subscribers. There's 5 million members in the NRA. I don't know where you lay on the scale there, but that's our channel of the day. Save the second. Now it is time for Gun Book of the Day. Taking a look at our Gun Book of the Day, going into our playlist for book reviews and heading down the list here. Sometimes we'll pick one at the top, sometimes we'll pick one at the bottom. Uh, we're going to start out with uh, a 2A1 because it's a 2A Tuesday. So why don't we go to the Gun Rights War? This is a quick video uh, doing a mail call Monday where we opened the book that we got in the mail uh, but the gun rights war was written well written by Neil Knox assembled and published by his sons and uh, it's an accumulation of articles that he's written he had written over the years as a writer for shotgun news and other publications uh, big uh, second amendment advocate hardcore constitutionalist Definitely a book worth checking out. If you don't already have it in your library, it's worth grabbing. Uh, it's a bunch of articles, so it's not necessarily a narrative or something you'd read from front to back. Uh, it's something, though, that you can read front to back, and you're just going to get a bunch of different uh, short stories, you know, a bunch of things that start and stop. Uh, so it actually makes it really easy to, uh, to consume uh, in pieces, uh, and then it's very valuable uh, knowledge to have. That's what this whole thing is about. If you know books that we're missing from our list, let us know. Uh, join us tonight and talk about the books that you like on uh, The Daily Gun Show. And now, it is time for our patron swap meet. This is where our patrons get free stuff if they want it from our patron-owned swap meet. All right, we're doing our Patreon swap meet. We just did number 17. We're going to roll for the number on this next one and it's going to be number 12 so this next one is going to be called number 12 pulling it over it's a smaller package this is some of the uh, prototypes from trying to make mr knives and the little dog mellow action figures so we played around this one's a mangled mr knives without a hand and without some toes i didn't nibble those off of there that just didn't fill the mold all the way you do got a pretty decent g there on them though and you get his turtle shell. It's a pretty decent cast, but not a perfect one. He won't stand up good, but maybe for some other kind of art or something. And then a little mellow dog. I kind of like this one, but uh, can't keep everything. So um, this was just sort of a first attempt uh, playing around with the uh, concept. Uh, I've moved on from that concept to go to something else anyway. But uh, hard plastic. They should last a little while for you. And a little Mr. Knives, Ninja Turtle, and a little mellow. Going along with that, we've got a little knife that'll go in there that I've used, so it's not a new knife or nothing. I'm just throwing it in there. Glock sticker for some reason. These are some wipes that were sent to me by Skip. Uh, Skip's Tactical. I'm going to pass them along because I don't use them. And uh, then a couple of little mini things. We've got the uh, mini catalog. These were just kind of an offshoot we printed. Um, immediately came up with a better idea, so this will be the only versions of the catalog like that are going out. Uh, with these swap meets and then a little passport so a little version of the uh, firearms museum passport also since you're getting the uh, action figures i'm guessing you're digging gun channels the concept of gun channels uh, gun channels next version of gun channels will be a graphic novel so in the preparation for that we have a blank graphic novel here so maybe somebody that'll dig this one will be interested in becoming uh, one of the artists for the new gun channels graphic novel 
So we'll give you this blank scratch pad to start with. We'll have uh, Mr. Knives and uh, Mellow action figures. Let's set him on that knife for the picture here. Oh, we need to write on here that this is going to be number 12. And let's see if we get everything into the picture here for the uh, thumbnail. I think we can. Boom. All right. So if you're interested in this one and you're a Patreon, uh, when we post over on Patreon about this, say that you're interested in number 12. Uh, this one will cost, I'm guessing, let's say, let's just make them all 10 bucks because I think this will probably cost like five, but you know, let's say 10 ish is the donation. You don't have to pay it if you don't want to. You're already a Patreon. So uh, this is just a uh, way that if you want to, I don't have to pay for shipping on this. But otherwise, we'll uh, send all this stuff out to whoever bids on this one. You have no obligation to take part in that comic, but if you do, uh, it would be kind of cool. I think I'm going to not seal this. Instead, put some more bubble in there so that those uh, don't get wrecked on you. And it's up to anybody. If you get something like this and you want me to put even like put this into one of these... I could do that. I'm going to have some more of these coming. In fact, I'll probably do that, especially if you're paying 10 bucks, because that'll cost seven bucks, seven bucks plus to ship that thing. Uh, but I don't want those figures to break on you. So uh, anyway, just for the video or whatever, we'll wrap it up. Oh, this only took about four minutes. So uh, that's the idea. We're doing a Patreon swap meet. We got a couple more of these to do. Each of the will be a little bit different. Stuff we picked up on the gun show loophole trail. Uh, some stuff we picked up at gun shows and things, um, and then just stuff we picked up along the way. Anyway, we're packaging some of that stuff out, packaging some of it up, sending it out to only our Patreons. If you're interested, say you want number 12, check out the other videos to see what the other packages are, or check out some of the pictures. Let us know in the comments what you think. Free Patch Friday, the happiest day of each week. Even folks who eat hot dogs so much as agree that free patches are the best. Get your free patches automatically when you buy cool two-way stuff from our gear website store. No codes, no minimum orders, no coupons. We have a growing library of books we write and print here in Tucson. Playing cards on firearm subjects, all printed in the USA. And we have patches with cool firearm designs. Other interesting unuseful stuff too. Thank you for supporting our projects through purchases at our gear website store. And this brings to a close the second installment of our daytime uh, slot. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the show. Let us know in the comments what you think. And of course, you're welcome to join us tonight on the live companion to this on the other channel, Daily Gun Show. Here on YouTube and then uh, over on GunStreamer and GunTube.org. The guys and gals of GunWebsites.com encourage you to take a CCW class every year, practice at least once a month, and carry every day. Thanks for watching GunWebsites.com. Come on, man. Firearms in film and entertainment each Wednesday. Millimeter. Luger. A fiery horse with the speed of light, a cloud of dust, and a hearty high Luger. The lone millimeter.